King Charles could be making over £1 million a year from renting out royal properties to holidaymakers, according to a new study. The royal family's impressive collection of historic houses and mansions are often rented out during holidays and are thought to make a hefty contribution to the palace's coffers. According to data sourced by holiday lettings experts, Pickle Insurance, the royals could be making as much as £118,775.85 per month, or around £1,425,310.20 per year from their holiday let portfolio. Even with cancellation figures taken into account, the monarchy would still be estimated to be bringing in a net annual income of just over £1.4 million. The four main royal properties taking bookings from the public include Balmoral Castle, the Castle of May's Captain House, Restormal Manor and Dumfries House, reports the express.co.uk. Cottages on the grounds of the royal family's favourite summertime retreat, Balmoral Castle in Scotland, are estimated to bring in £36,798.30 per month after accounting for anticipated cancellations. The most profitable of them all, the 500-year-old Restormal Manor in Cornwall, meanwhile brings in a very healthy £47,082 per month, according to the figures. There are four different areas available for the public to book alongside six different converted barns on the property, which is located in the Foy Valley. Dumfries House in Ayrshire, Scotland, Meanwhile adds an estimated £31,185.63 and, and has 25 rooms available to book. The Castle of May's Captain House in the Scottish Highlands is said to bring in a more modest £3,709.92 monthly, even though the entire property is available to book. The researchers said, While the primary role of the royal family is undoubtedly to serve the nation, it's clear that their properties also represent a valuable asset. These figures underscore the significant financial potential of the royal estate and offer a fascinating glimpse into the business side of the monarchy. Official figures released in July revealed that royal family was allocated £86.3 million for the last financial year from the taxpayer-funded sovereign grant. All profits made from the Crown estate, including royal households, forestry, agriculture, and offshore wind are paid directly to the Treasury and a percentage of this cash, currently 12%, is given back to the royal family to support their duties. The accounts also span a time of celebration, with coronation and festivities celebrating the crowning of the King and Queen in May last year.